Well, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. The completion of round one of the NRL for 2007. And Mark Guy, Monday night footy. The Rabbitohs get home 12 6 against the Roosters. How'd you see it? Jimmy, great game. Um, enthusiasm was there in the first half. Even though the Roosters. Uh, Completion rate was down a bit in the second half. I still see some good signs. Um, I'm not convinced yet on Nutley and Beattie as a front row forwards. I know you you're a big fan of Nutley tonight. I thought he went well. Yeah, I, I, I thought he made an impact at times, mm. and, and certainly defensively he did a lot of work. Uh, Chris Beattie, I agree with you. I'm not so sure on that, but I think the two front rowers are the least of the problems mm. of, the, of the Roosters tonight. They just John Monaghan, um, obviously coming back from a major injury last year, mm. uh, ditto with uh, Anthony Minicello, and they look like it. They look like they were yeah. out for a long period of time, but. It was, a, it was a great round of rugby league. I mean, the, probably the pick of the round as far as teams go, I, I, I couldn't go past the Cowboys. I think the Cowboys with Jonathan Thurston at the helm, they've got Luke O'Donnell, they've got Matthew Scott and Lilliman who played Origin last yep. year. Yep. Uh, Found Moina and Jason Smith, two great boys. They're the team, it's very early days. Let's not get carried away with ourselves, but after the first round, I, you've got to say the Cowboys were by far the most inspiring team. Yeah, I agree with you, they were impressive. In terms of the most impressive game, uh, the Bulldogs and Knights match. <sighs> Yesterday, oh, you could ask for that in a grand final and say, "Well, that's a great grand final." And mm. there it was, round one of the competition. Three minutes into the game, you've got the two superstars on show, Sonny Bill Williams and Andrew Johns, coming together. Johns leaves on a stretcher. Williams leaves because the referee said he had to. In handcuffs. <laughs> in handcuffs. Uh, and all of a sudden, the other players lifted, and we saw a great game of footy. Overall, I've got to say, and I'll get your opinion on this. Overall, if I'm a rugby union administrator and I look at the first round of the NRL, I think. Wow, we have got some competition. I agree with you, three hundred percent, Jimmy. I think that the the, the Bulldogs and the uh, Knights game, yeah, that was unbelievable. You, you, you're watching the game next minute, you see the game's best player and potentially the game's best player both involved in a. I wonder what would have happened if the roles were reversed. If it was Andrew Johns doing the hit on on Sunny Bill Williams. Bill, yeah. that, uh, I know it's a conspiracy theory type of plot, but. Look, you're in you Newcastle. You're in Newcastle. They're baying. <laughs> the referee's going. I can't get out of here alive. They're, right. they're baying for yeah. blood. Yeah. Um, look, I hope to think that they don't go on an injury and, and send him off because that was, it was a nasty hit from yeah. Sonny Bill. But look, some other, the, the Titans. Their first game in the competition was sensational. Yeah. They look the Dragons. Very look. They went great without their big superstars. Nathan Brown. He, you know, he's, he's coming along in leaps and bounds. So was the coach next door us tonight in, in, in Jason Taylor. Passionate players. Passionate coaches. I love it. And speaking of the Titans, we're up there next week, so we'll see you there at Carrara. Looking forward to that Can't one. Can't wait to be. And the Sharks. Uh, that's all from Footy Tips TV. Until next week, see you later.